this is Nash from Tesla and the Gong. Today I'm going to show you how you can charge your car in one of these things. So these are charge point chargers. There are a few charge point chargers around. Now these chargers have a type 1 cable in them. And we have a type 2 in our car and that's why you need one of these. These are called a type 1 to type 2 cable. And uh, you have to use this if you want to charge your Tesla. As you can see, uh, one end has got a, a type 1 adapter to it. You can see the type 1 adapter. And the other one, other end is the normal Tesla type 2 adapter that we are all used to using. So this is what you need, a type 1 to type 2 cable. I will leave a link to this in the description of this video so you can check that out. Um, now we're going to try and uh, use this to charge uh, our cars. So what you need is, you need one of the charge point apps. So this is a charge point charger. You need a charge point app. In my case, I have the charge point app and I'm also added that to, um, to my phone's uh, a wallet so you can add these nfc tags to your phone's wallet and you can use this nfc tag to tra to trigger the charge all you need to do is bring your nfc tag and hold it near the charger like so it says waiting and card is authenticating and now you can pull out one of these uh one of these cables so you can pull this out so there you go so you got this and now you need to plug this onto the other side of this so you need to match the ports like so and plug that in and now you can plug the other end of this cable to your, your charger right here. And once the connection is all right, you have the green flashing light and you can see it's starting to charge here as well. It says 52 seconds. It's just going to start charging now. There you go, it's charging at 0 0.06 kilowatts. These are AC chargers and they're not DC chargers. So they are slow trickle charge. And this particular charger here is in uh, Westfield Miranda. And while I go and shop or go and have my meal, the car is taking some charge. So trickle charge keeps going in more than enough to put in a few kilometers if you're here for an hour or so. I have more cable related videos in my channel. So do click on that subscribe button. We'll come back very soon. As you know, we came in at 9.50 a.m. and plugged in by about 10.18. We still had 2 hours and 25 minutes to go and we were putting in about 32 kilometers an hour at 30 amps with 232 volts. Alright guys, time now is 1.20. I got the notification saying that the car is fully charged. Now we're ready to go. Now if you want to unlock this, a couple of uh, uh, software updates ago, we got this um, unlock button so we can press that and then the light will change to light blue and now you can unlock the car even in a third party charger. I believe previously it was only for Tesla superchargers, now third party chargers are also possible. So that's all done. Now you have to unhook this. To unhook this, you have to go back to your uh, wallet, go into the charge point NFC tag, just place near, the, near there and it says done. Once it's done, now you're ready to remove the cable. So. That's all done. So that is 346 kilometers state of charge in my 2018 75D Model S. And the reason why I went to a higher state of charge is because I'm traveling from Miranda all the way to Tari, which is about 335 kilometers. Now I didn't want to have any range anxiety, so I charged to a higher state of charge at this time. But I also want to introduce an app here. This is called Need to Charge. I want you to all download this and set it up so that if somebody wants to charge, and wants to get priority all they need to do is enter your car's number plate and that will send you a notification saying that somebody wants to really charge so you can choose to go and remove your car giving them the opportunity to charge their cars so i charged here for about three hours and 25 minutes and my car accepted 21.43 kilowatt hours of electricity which is essentially free to me now this is a testament to the ev revolution so you can see all these are EVs here which are charging here in Miranda and there's one more Model 3 over there who's waiting to charge. I suppose once we take out the car they will come to charge and here as well we have a Model X. So the EV revolution is happening here in Australia guys. We are in the precipice of some massive change so let's wait for more. Now these Type 1 chargers are not one-off chargers. There are a fair few of these all around Australia. Uh, in particular, I found this one in the International Convention Centre in Darling Drive, Sydney. Uh, unfortunately, a few of these bays were iced, but even so, there is a whole host of these chargers in this fantastic car park in Darling Drive, Sydney. All you need to do is come here and park 
and then you get a free charge while you go and shop or while you're attending a concert so on and so forth so these are here to stay now that's all folks thank you very much for watching if you are in the market for a Tesla of your own, an S3, X or a Y anywhere in the world, kindly consider using my referral code. The description of this video has all details of the same. Both of us will get 1,500 kilometers or 1,000 miles of free supercharger credits. And in my case, my supercharger credits are tied to my hire car, which I hire out of Canberra via ev.com.au. Details are there in the description as well. Please do consider using my referral code. And while you're at it, a subscription to the channel will be highly appreciated. I'll see you guys in another interesting video very soon. Until then, this is Nash from Tesla in the Gong, signing off. Peace.